Hey, so why is a plateau one of the best things that can happen in your journey, your keto journey, your fat loss journey, your health journey, but also one of those things that ticks you off the most, actually flat out irritates you, makes you frustrated than ever? Okay, so let's just paint a picture here. You're going through a transformation, your body's shifting and changing, and and you're, you just stall, everything stops. Well, the reality is, is that might be a really important thing. I'm gonna give you some tips, not only how to break the plateau, but also to realize that, appreciate the foundation that's being established. So it's no different than building a house, right? I'm in a house right now where there's a beautiful house, right? The, the first thing we lay down is a foundation. With a strong foundation, we can build to the second second floor. And so when we start building the second floor, it seems like the house is stopping. It's like it's slowing down. Well, what are they doing is they have to build the floor to establish some stability so that we can build the next, next level, the next layer. And that keeps going on and on and on and on. So the same thing with your journey. If you're on a fat loss, most people, let's be honest, you're, it's your fat loss journey that stalled or plateaued, right? It's not usually your performance, but the same thing applies to performance. So when you plateau, what's happening inside your body is it's, it's establishing a new normal, a new baseline, a new stability. And it takes time for that to happen. So then you can go and basically go break the plateau and your body can go further. You never see, 25 years, I've never seen somebody's like weight loss or fat loss journey go steadily down. It always is going to plateau from time to time. So there's a few lessons you're going to learn here. Number one, it's important for your health. And I can give you a lot of reasons why. It's actually, from an illness perspective, it's actually safer for you to establish some levels of plateaus because your body, when it metabolizes fat, at the same time of metabolizing fat, your body's actually, if you don't know this, you store toxins in your fat. So it's rather be stored there than anywhere else because it doesn't have to be used. But if you're on a fat loss journey and you've been exposed to anything in the world, if you live in the modern day world, you've been exposed to stuff, your body has to now bring out those toxins are released back into your system and your body has to detox it out. So when your body plateaus, it's quite possible it's doing that to slow down fat loss so that your body can then maintain, start to detox everything that's been, been lost so far. And that's important for your health. If you kept losing the weight, it would toxic load would go up and you'd actually feel worse. You'd actually feel bad and actually get sick. You don't want that. But you may not know that, so you get mad, you get frustrated, you quit, you stop, and then guess what? You gained it all back, right? Because you just threw your hands up. But it was actually protecting you from being ill, not being healthy. So that's one of the main reasons. The other main reason a plateau is so important is it's actually when you learn the most about you. It learns about your temperament. You learn about your, 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 your how you're feeling. Let's check in. Some people, they start on their fat loss journey, their keto journey, and they're going after it. A lot of people are using our amazing tool, our amazing drink, and they're losing weight and they're losing weight, but they've been following in a more structured, low-carb lifestyle. And then the holiday happens, a birthday happens, they slowly drift away. They slowly stop following that same lifestyle, or they stop being as active because now school's getting busy and life's getting busy. So they're not doing the same thing they were doing before. This is a great time when you plateau is reassess. What did you do originally is it the same as what you're doing now? If the answer is no, then you probably need to go back to what you were doing that got your results in the first place. But humans are funny people where we we basically think we're doing the same thing, but we weren't doing the same thing. I've seen it all the time in my career. I, I'm doing the same thing, Dustin. Are you? Are you really? Take a moment and this is time to reflect back. The only time I ever recommend measuring anything is on a plateau. This is a time to kind of assess. Are your carbon takes going up higher? Are you less active? Are you sleeping less? Are you eating later at night? Are you drinking less water? Are you moving your body less? These are the times to reassess. So you get to learn on a plateau. It's what makes a plateau so perfect is because you learn, you stay healthy, and then once you basically accept the plateau as being an important part of your journey, boom, you break it and you take off. Couple tips on how to break the plateau is this, is go back and reassess. Make sure your carbs are lower. Make sure you didn't sneak them up a little bit. Let's not eat too close to bed. Let's keep your body moving, be mobile as much as you possibly can, and do the reboot with us. If you're not doing a metabolic reset every month with us, then you're missing the boat. And to get information about the reboot, just go down below, you'll check it out, and you can come contact me and I'll help you get started on the reboot. But it's a great plateau buster to help you get through that journey. But appreciate plateaus. This is business, this is life. If anywhere in your life you have a plateau, it's the most important time to you to learn to grow and launch yourself to the another phase of your life, another phase of your health journey, another phase of your transformation. So plateaus are really, really important to be successful. And if you appreciate them faster, you'll have way more success faster. So check it out. Hey, if you want to subscribe to our channel down below, check it out and come subscribe with us. Come check out more videos. Hey, thanks for watching the video. Just subscribe below if you want all the updates when we upload the newest videos on keto health, wellness, vitality. Check it out. Come join us.